Hello everyone and welcome to the Serket project, this project will show the history of the fictional exoplanet Serket. This episode will show over the course of 20 million years the diversification of the three animal phyla shown in the previous episode. The first group to emerge will be the Arthronautans, predatory animals descended from Arthrozoa that have adapted to swim near the seafloor sucking up and consuming soft-bodied animals, it has evolved more segments for flexibility and lost all but the two frontmost pair of gills to reduce drag. The Conchomorpha are descended from Platybranchia that evolved a calcium carbonate shell for protection against predators like the Arthronautans it has evolved the ability to retract its arm into its shell to protect itself, as the microbial mat began to disappear it adapted to feed on the increasing amount of algae. The Anthobrachia are descended from Conchomorpha that adapted to filter feed on plankton carried by the currents using its feather-like arm, and evolved a two-part shell for better protection and the shell has smoothened to look more like a rock. The Ichthyocaridia descended from Arthrozoa that have adapted to feed on plankton and other small animals and have adapted to be more fish-like and live higher in the water column, it has a set of spiracles in the gaps between segments replacing the feathery gills of the ancestral Arthrozoa and has a more efficient circulatory system to increase endurance. The Acanthopinna are descended from Ichthyocaridia that began to feed on other kinds of Ichthyocaridia, it evolved a set of pincer-like jaws and a more streamlined body for the role of a predator. The Trullostoma descended from the same lineage that lead to the Ichthyocaridia, it has adapted to consume whatever it can find on the sea floor evolving 18 jointed legs to walk across the sea floor as well as two jointed limbs used to shovel food into its mouth. The Cryptobranchia descended from Arthronautens that began to burrow through the sediment on the sea floor for protection against predators, it has evolved a cover over its gills as to not clog them with sediment and a longer slimmer body to easily fit into burrows. Now that I have covered the first 20 million years of this project I will see you in the next episode where these animals will adapt to a new environment. Goodbye.